Okay, so we are now on our way to the lanes, which is another big reason to be in Brighton. The Brighton lanes are so awesome, full of character, shops, British fudge, um, Rolly's fudge, uh, maybe beads, yogurts, fudge. I mean, I don't know, but it's got a lot of those kind of things. But truthfully, it's a, just a really cool spot um, with a lot of cultural diversity and it's just really awesome to be walking around there. So we're just heading there with the family right now, walking down here, hey, and uh, yeah, enjoying walking down memory lane if you like, with all the kids and Nana and Granddad and the whole family. Nana and Granddad right over there, hiding, but it's okay. We're good, we're good. We just got them in there, they know they're there. It's Mr. Van Gogh! Woo! <laughs> Dude! I can't oh believe it's you, man! Oh my goodness, sir. How big is Mr. Van Gogh is here! What are they feeding you there? Chicken. Chicken. It's crazy! <laughs> it's good! Hey, buddy! Well, that was crazy. Just want to give a big shout out to Ryan and Liz Van Gogh. Liz, where were you? Liz, where were you at? We're here in Brighton. We see your husband, but you weren't there. What's the deal? But it was really nice just to have a surprise catch up for a couple minutes. You know, old buddies. See this Brighton trip is just bringing up some good memories, good friends, good people, good places. It's cool, nice and fun, right huh? Yeah. <laughs> but that was crazy, you imagine. Coming from, from the Philippines, haven't seen them in years. Bump into them here in Brighton. What's the deal? What is the deal? It's a cool deal. Anyway, signing out on that. Big shout out to Ryan and Liz and the whole beautiful family. Whoa, looking so cool, Mike. Good night. Look at those reflections. Oh, that's me in there. Okay, so we are finally here at the famous lane. As you'll see behind Rosie and I, this is where we spent many uh, an hour walking. Yeah, it's a lot of fun down here, a lot of things to do, a lot of things to see. It's a good adventure. Fudge. Frozen yogurt. Food. <laughs> food. Sunshine, just like Great it is today. Street musicians. Street musicians, as you see behind over my shoulder. One minute. Music shops, you name it, this is a cool place to go and wander around. Anyway, let's go show you a little bit what it looks like. So anyway, this is us walking through the lanes. It, as you can see, it is pretty cool here. So much action, so many shops, weird things. Yeah, you name it, it happens here. Cats as an astronaut. Psh, yeah, cats with as astronauts. And then weird legs sticking out of buildings. I just want to show you. See that? Yeah, that is strange. But all good. That right there is the store that I have spent too much money on in the past, so I will not go in there. No. For the record, no. <laughs> I'll hold you to that. I'm saying no. Good pain. All right, I just wanted to share this little quick fact here. Down, down this road, on these walls on the back that you'll see, they always have these murals with artists showcasing their different artwork and talent. And I just find it really unique because every time I've come here, obviously now it's a few years apart, but most of the time when you come, every month there's some new artwork that's done here on the street and some of it is just phenomenal. So anyway, we're just nice finding and catching this. Have a look at some of this art right here.
Okay, so Rosie and I are probably in the coolest part of the lanes, the best streets here. As you'll see, as we're walking through here, it's got the most diverse shops and yeah. places to drink Everything coffee. Everything going on, the best diverse people. Yeah, it's just cool, you know, if you just want to experience a little bit of everything. This is definitely the street to be in. Yeah, so if you come and visit Brighton, you gotta come to the North Lanes and check this out. Anyway, just gonna enjoy the colors, the vibrance, and the fudge. And the fudge. Are we gonna have some of the uh, frozen yogurt? Frozen yogurt. Let's go get this. Uh, The infamous Rolly's Fudge. And again, another place where we have spent way too much money in the past. And now Mike is just about to go. Hey, Mike, why are you sitting there, buddy? Mike. What's the deal, bud? <laughs> okay, that's where all the delicious fudge is cut up. Cool down on the marble. How cool is that? Wait a second. You think we should get this, Leah? Tell the camera. Or I say yes. Yes. Yes to that. Yes to this. Yes. Look at that. Yes to chocolate fudge. Yes to chocolate fudge, exactly. Sweetie, I think we should leave this with this store. Thanks so much, guys. Well, that pretty much wraps up our Brighton reminiscing memory lane party, doesn't it? It was amazing, really, really amazing day. It was so cool, and yeah, we're just heading back now to uh, our brother's house so that we could pick up little Oscar, his dog, and then head on back home to Nana and Granddad. I've got to say, Brighton is cool, and if you ever come to England, you must stop off at Brighton. Brighton. Prioritize what she says. I always prioritize what she says, not what I say. But anyway, signing out of Brighton. Thanks for joining us on this little fun and excursion. See you later. See ya. Okay, well, that kind of ends our Brighton reminisce and excursion coming back here. It's been a beautiful day, just walking memory lane. Yeah, it has been. It's an incredible day. I want to do it again. <laughs> and yeah, I think we probably will. But if you're ever in England, prioritize Brighton. What she says, prioritize. I can't even say. It. Anyway, Brighton, do the it. lanes, do it. It's fun. Anyway, sign out. Brighton's over until the next one. See ya. See ya. And here's a fox that's just chilling out in the backyard of Nana's house. How cool is that?